What's this one called? That gets my goat. Really? That's what we're going with? Okay. Hey, everybody. This is Big Anklevich. Welcome to another That Gets My Goat on the Dune Steve Audio Fiction magazine. I have here by my side the angry Rich Outfield. Say hello to the folks at home, Rich Outfield. Hello to the folks at home. You know, I, I shouldn't be angry, actually. I mean, we, we've got a topic today that's, uh, I'd say it's passion-free, right? At, the, at Comic-Con, they, they showed what uh, the Wonder Woman costume would look like in the upcoming uh, Superman v. Batman. Sorry, what is it called? I think it is Superman v. Batman. That's opposite of that. Oh, oh, it's Batman v. Superman? Okay. Batman v. Superman, colon. I guess that Superman makes sense since it's not Superman's movie anymore that he wouldn't get first billing. Batman v. Superman, colon, Dawn of Justice. This movie will have Wonder Woman in some sort of a role in it. And, uh, yeah, they showed what her costume was going to be like. And everybody got to get their first look at this costume. At Gal Gadot. As uh, as Wonder Woman, but the the, the problem is, what were we we weren't going to say anything negative. We're only going to focus on yeah. The we were going to talk positive. about this costume, and yeah, I mean it's easy. We we know that we've been very negative in the past about Warner Brothers and the Man of Steel stuff, and just the kind of direction that they've taken stuff. So what we're going to do this time around is we're going to just focus on the positive aspects. Of you know the the Wonder Woman costume release and all that, and we're just gonna we're we're gonna stick with that this time. Right. Okay. Well, I'll go first. Wonder Woman is a very important character. She's an iconic character. She's she's part of the big three. She's one of the four or five most famous superheroes in the world, and her and her costume is part of that. That's true. She definitely lives up to to that. She's very uh, she's a big deal. And it's important to, to get it right. And it's good to have her in a movie after all these years. And and to have have somebody believe in her enough to say, okay, we're going to do Wonder Woman in a movie. Yeah, up, and, up until now, Wonder Woman's only appearance on the silver screen was her appearance in the Lego movie. <laughs> so it's nice to, to, to see Warner Brothers finally believe in Wonder Woman enough to allow her to appear on the silver screen... And they cast a woman in yes. the role. That is good. Okay, so positives about the costume, the costume choice that they made. You you have seen the picture? So. I did, yeah. I saw the picture. Um, I, I took a look at it. I even showed it to my wife. I can't tell you what her comment was. Oh, because we're staying positive. Because we're only doing the positive stuff, so uh, I won't mention that any further. Um, but how about your children? Did they see the, the picture? Did they? No, I don't oh, think so. Oh, that's negative. You can't say that. But your your family, you ever, your wife knew who Wonder Woman was. Well, right. Yes, she does Even know. in Canada, Wonder Woman is famous. That's right. All and the way up in the great white north, they you, know Wonder Woman. Your children know who Wonder Woman is? So, they yeah. do, yeah. My son likes Wonder Woman enough. My, my little one, the two-year-old, anytime he finds a rope somewhere, he pretends to be Wonder Woman. It's interesting, you know, he, he looks up to Wonder Woman, he likes Wonder Woman, looks up to her, he, it doesn't matter that she's a girl, my boy will pretend to be Wonder Woman because cool. she's a powerful and, and important superhero, and he sees all the cartoons on Netflix and stuff, so he knows Wonder Woman and likes Wonder Woman. Okay, so, alright, let's buckle down. Positives about the... Brown, I mean, about the new the new costume, costume, Wonder Woman costume. All right, that's all the time we have for today, folks. Uh, thanks for listening, and uh, yeah, um, we'll see you again next time. Maybe we'll have uh, something more to say uh, about the Guardians of the Galaxy. Oh, that would be nice. Yeah, maybe maybe there's something uh, positive to say there too. Yeah, yeah, that'd be good. All right, thanks for listening. See you later, folks. Good night. That gets my goat is produced under a Creative Commons 3.0 license. Doesn't have to be, but it is. 
my boy will pretend to be Wonder Woman because cool. she's an important superhero. Likes Wonder Woman. I showed the costume to him, and he said, "Who the fuck is that, Dad?" Wait, this is this. So this oh, was your fourteen-year-old oh. son, then? No, no, no. That was the two-year-old. The two-year-old um, son said this. <laughs> we probably ought to cut that out because that, that wasn't positive. That'll be in the outtakes if you want. <laughs>